Easter PA Weather 30 meteorologist Bobby Marchich here with your outlook for December 21st, 2016. Today is officially the first day of winter. The winter solstice arrives at 544 a.m. this morning across the region. We're going to have high pressure and control of our weather today. So it's going to start off mostly sunny. Uh, I do think some clouds are going to increase as we head toward uh, mid to late afternoon, maybe the evening for areas farther east. But uh, uh, we'll definitely start off mostly sunny, and temperatures will be a little bit warmer than they have been the last couple of days, but not really warm yet. It's going to be generally, uh, I will give it a, maybe two or three degrees above normal for this time of year as far as highs are concerned. So not a big deal um, as far as this. Uh, this isn't like a real warm push here. Uh, but temperatures are going to be in the 40s in many locations. And as the high pressure moves off to the south, you also have the system moving in from the northwest. This is going to be responsible for that increase in cloud cover out ahead of it. Uh, just a weak system here. going to have a cold front with it uh, situated like this. There's actually a little warm front ahead of this, too, giving some, some snow off to the north. Uh, but uh, we don't expect, while we don't expect uh, any precipitation in our coverage area, we do expect uh, clouds to increase late today. And uh, overnight, well, we're expecting mostly cloudy skies. Wouldn't be surprised to see a passing uh, snow shower or flurry for the far northern tier, but not a real big deal here. And then again, uh, as we get into uh, Friday behind this, high pressure is going to move in again. So we're going to have another mostly sunny day. But again, the, the high pressure is off to our south. So being in this position down here, you still, have a, you still have a wind flow out of the west or west-southwest, and that's going to give you temperatures are going to be on the mild side. So we're not talking about temperatures that are going to be, whoa, we went a right way ahead there. We're not talking about temperatures that are going to be really, um, really warm. So these aren't Bermuda highs here. Uh, but at the same time, uh, we have no cold pushes either. Now we do have to watch for another little system. It's a very weak system. And the models are starting to pick up on this. And this is a uh, force for late Friday night and early Saturday morning. Uh, of course, Saturday is the is Christmas Eve, so uh, the models are starting to hint at, hint at a few snow showers, rain or snow showers, very early in the morning, and uh, that 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 could occur basically for our western and northern sections as it stands right now. Further east, if you go to the next frame here, you can see uh, this kind of falls apart. Let me get to that next frame. Kind of falls apart. Maybe you have an isolated shower here or there Saturday morning. And that's about it. So again, it could if it comes in here early enough for areas uh, in the far western and northern areas, at least as it stands right now, uh, could have a rain and or snow shower very early on. Again, not not amounting to anything here, uh, and this doesn't look like a big deal. I will say that the European model is a little bit more enthused than the GFS is here, which is pictured and across the northern tier uh, has some minor accumulations here generally an inch or so but I mean again this is not a big deal right now we will keep a keep an eye on this we're now talking about something a system that here is under uh, under 96 hours away so uh, again high pressure off the south here so Saturday is gonna be a warm day regardless and then we get into uh, Christmas Day itself and now looks like it's going to be dry as the, as we look, looked at it yesterday it looked like there could be uh, a warm front moving through that net with a few showers and that does now uh, it does not look like the case right now uh, going through the day here on Christmas Day does look dry uh, partly cloudy skies and then we have a system moving off well to our northwest you can see that up in this region here is going to have a cold front with it with a few showers that are going to come in here uh, probably after Christmas this is looking like uh, late later Monday or Monday evening but it doesn't look like it has a, uh, has a lot of precipitation with it and it will be in the form of rain when it does so uh, and then behind it we start to uh, cool down a little bit uh, from where we were as you're going to warm up ahead of that front here on uh, on Monday uh, might be close to 50 in some locations or into the 50s and down here by Philadelphia but uh, we do expect it to cool down once this cold front comes back through, at least back down to near normal temperatures. So nothing, no extremes here, no extreme high or low. You just have the same uh, pattern where it warms up briefly ahead of any war any cold front coming in, and then the cold front comes through and you're back down to near normal again. So it's an up and down kind of pattern that we're going to be in through uh, the end of the new of the, of this year anyway and perhaps extending into the first week of January. I'm Eastern PA Weather 30 meteorologist Bobby Marchers. That is your outlook for December 21st, 2016. Have a great Wednesday.